If you need Madden 21 coins for anything, make sure to go to buymuttcoins.com. It's cheap and reliable, and my code MMG is 20% off. Down Bad Chronicles, Volume 2, Episode 69, The Ballad of Papa Meeks. Dude, I'm down so bad. I'm down so bad, bro. Dude, I'm not, I'm not even finna, I'm not even finna fob it, Boys, would I lie to you? I am so hungover. Listen, gentlemen, if you're gonna drink the alcohol, I want you to do it responsibly. Don't ever get anywhere near a vehicle, ever. Don't even think about driving it. I would personally kill you if you ever did that. But I would be lying if I told you guys I didn't drink a little bit. And I woke up this morning and it felt like I got a train ran on me. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, 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 no. It felt like I got hit by a train. That is what I meant to say. Spit right in the face. The train hitting me, not the train. All right. Hey, also, if you guys are uh, interested in my life, um, I'm moving to Hawaii for 50 days. Pretty, that's pretty dope. I don't know, like three nights ago, I was uh, sitting in my bed. I was like, bruh, I should go live in Hawaii. So I'm, go I'm gonna go, uh, I'm gonna go there. I'm so good. <laughs> Holy shit. I'm going to Oahu, Honolulu. I've been to Hawaii a few times, favorite place on earth. So I'm excited to live there for a little bit. Don't worry though, I'm bringing all my I'll still be making videos. It's for um, half of April, all of May, half of June. And then after that, I'm back to Michigan. After that, who knows? All right, I know you don't give a shit. Oh, do you want your video monkey to ooga booga make the wheel of mud? Okay. I don't know. I'm at this like huge crossroads between my team is so good and I can barely compete because my team is bad. All right, boys, I also spent some time today fixing the wheels. I completely revamped the wheel. I got tons of new fun wheel spins on here and some awesome new challenges too. So first the wheel spin, I would take a middle linebacker. I would take a right outside linebacker. I would definitely take an elite wide receiver, but it all depends on what we can get. Woo! All right, I have been fumbling the bag on these because I keep losing the game. So this is only relevant if I can win the game. I sub in any bench player. For every yard I get, I get 2,000 coins. So for example, if Damian Harris has 100 yards, 200,000 coins. Or if Damian Harris has 100 yards and prime time, my backup has 100 yards, that's 400K. So there's a lot of potential with this. I just gotta be in a position where I can sub my bench players in and really, you know, go off. I cannot do this with quarterback though. I can't sub Deshaun Watson in and pass. However, I could sub Deshaun Watson in and scram. I think passing's a little too too cheese, at least from quarterbacks. I just run like slip screens and slants and shit. And... All right, cool. That's our first wheel spin. Doesn't help us right now, but like if I get that many coins and I can choose the player, I'm getting Tyree Kill. So we'll keep that in mind. We gotta go absolutely off with our bench players. Our next wheel spin is going to be. What you got for me, baby? What you got for me? Ah! No, I can't do this shit today, bro. Push-ups times 3K. Uh, all the push-ups have to be done in succession. I would be blessed if I get over 30 right now because holy shit. If you talk shit about my form, you better be in my Twitter DMs with a video of your form being better. I actually don't know how the hell I just did that, dude. That was some crackhead energy right there. 50 push-ups times 3,000 coins is 150,000 coins to spend on any one player. I'm gonna go with the right tackle. I lost my right tackle last episode. So I could get Lane Johnson or Bulaga. I'm gonna go with Bulaga because I like these uh, I like these new cards anyway. Big time, baby. Brian Bulaga. Hey, now let's just hope we can lock him into the team. All right, so here's the challenge reel. Hopefully we get one of the new cool ones that I just added. There are still some of the old ones on there. So there's a chance I don't, but... <laughs> I remember this. This one isn't even new. This has been on the wheel so long we just never got it. Before I get in the red zone, I have to message my opponent and tell him exactly what I'm gonna run. And I still have to score running that play. No way, that is your team. From the heavens, are you kidding me? Let's go. Yo, his three letter abbreviation is nut. Yo, this guy's a stud. It's gonna motion one man out. I kinda wanna watch the underneath route and I also wanna get right on the QB. I'm torn here. Dude, he's playing legit. I feel so bad. Let's get all the bench players in on this single back formation here. So instead of D-Jax, we'll go Julio. Primetime can go right there. And then instead of Darren Waller, we'll go Kyle Rudolph. This is really nice too, because my team is good. I almost could just burn her, Julio. Come on, Julio. Go, Julio. I feel bad. Go get it, Julio! My man! My man! I 
right. Well, that's huge for our challenge because that's a bench player and that's a good 60 yards right there, I think. Hopefully he doesn't rage quit too fast so I can actually see the yardage. Darren Waller. Dude, honestly, that's the toughest part about having like an overall disadvantage on your team is you get hit so hard. Like, you just get bullied by like hit power and speed and then you end up fumbling all the time. Like, I really think this dude knows what he's doing at least to some degree. That's a solid play. Oh, he's making business decisions. This man is smart. Let's see if he wants to throw a little screen underneath. See if he still likes that. No, he wants to throw right here. Ooh, he's lobbing it up. Landon College show. Woo! That was glitchy. Go! Damn it! All right, hold up. Let me send him a message. Dude, I almost, like, I don't even want to do the challenge. It's cool when it's a competitive game. I'm just going to feel like an ass. I really don't want to send this. Halfback dive. I'm so sorry. I literally feel like such an asshole. I'm just going to run halfback dive from this far out that I am right now. We'll see if I get the touchdown. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, Dalvin's in. Shit, that could have been. That could have been Damian Harris yards. But hey, we got the challenge done. I feel so mad. I literally feel like an ass, bro. All right, we're going for the two-point D-Jax. Yes, sir. Damn. He was blanketed, too. Dude, if he plays this game out, though, <laughs> I could end up getting, like, literally a jackpot, basically. I could get, like, a million coins. I'm actually going to bait this slant. I'm going to bait it. I'm going to sit low with Jamal and then pick it off. Oh, damn. Damn. Mine. <gasps> Other than the interception, which was kind of unlucky, he has not missed a pass. Ooh, heater around the edge. All right, second and 18. He wants a slant. He wants this one right here. Oh, his first incomplete pass. It's third and 18. I don't even want him to get a field goal, if I'm being honest. So I'm going to send the house here. Ah! Yeah, he's legit. He really is legit, bro. He's not going to run the ball. He's going to try and throw over the middle, and he does. Man, just dotting me with this with this mini Seahawks theme team here. That was nasty. How did he even do that? All right, I'm actually going to just... I'm just going to go down right here on the four, so this would be an additional 96 yards. All right, let's see what he's going to go with here. Does Julio have this slant? Oh, my God. I think Julio burnt that post. So this isn't even... <laughs> This isn't even fair. And I'm getting 2K per yard on this. This is clutch. Let's go, Julio. All right, DJX on another slant. I think he knows I'm going there, but I don't think he can stop it. What the? I should play hungover more often. What is going on? I think I can bait a slant. Ooh, he does not get the pass off. That's the two minute warning. Fourth and 12. Where's he looking? It's fourth and 12. Where's he looking? Let's go, but we want the yards with the bench players. Jamal, take this shit back. We will cheese. I could literally do anything with Julio. Julio is going ballistic. Damn, he's kind of on it. This user's just so slow. I'm gonna go Rudolph right in the middle. Gonna snag some extra yards. Yeah. 198 yards to bench players right now. That is 396,000 coins. Talk about bench players, bro. I got Rob Havenstein at tight end here. We're definitely getting him some yards right now. This should be a laser to Havenstein. Wait, wait for him to clear. There he is. <laughs> Catch it. Bro! Ooh, none of these players are bench players. I'll just throw Darren Waller right off the jump. I don't want the touchdown. I need bench players. All right, we're going to go to Julio on this or possibly Damian Harris out the backfield. Um, let's just go Damian Harris. Ooh, he kind of saw it developing, but Damian Harris is breaking tackles. Let's let Damian Harris sit in the middle of the field. We'll block everybody and then we'll use your playmaker. Depends what we see. All right. All right. Let's send Damian Harris up and just throw it because why not? And he's gonna come down with that shit. And now we send break to the end zone. We just throw a laser. He's in a cover three. This is a touchdown. This is a laser touchdown to break. There it is. There it is. Oh. I don't know what I was going for there, but then my voice started to crack. So I just, yeah, it's pretty cringy. I'm sorry. This guy's putting up with my bullshit right now. I respect it. Hey, Hawks bomb. I'm gonna make sure I sauce you. That really good DK Metcalf. You deserve it, bro. Cause I know he's a Seahawks fan. I want to see what Hawks players he has. His name is not in your mom. That is an awesome, awesome, awesome name. All right. So at wide receiver, he has, yeah, he has an 80 overall DK. Okay. We're getting him the 95 DK. 
I need to get water. And food, honestly. A few minutes later. Uber Eats got here, bro. Uber Eats just got here. This is so clutch. Look at my LA bitch ass, bro. I got I got avocado toast. You're definitely allowed to make fun of me, you guys. So you can make fun of me for that. I really don't have to play defense either. Like, I'm serious. Actually, there's a window he can throw right there. Oh, no, we're fine. Look at the message he sent me. He said, Johnny Sins brutally destroys Minor and Madden. What a good dude. Respect, Hawks Bomb. Oh, damn, but I still gotta, I still gotta moss you, bro. Oh, Tyler Lockett got in the way. I'm just gonna choose some clock here. I know I could keep running it up, but I don't plan on it. Fourth and goal, a goal line stand. Same exact play. Get there. Damn. Oh, he's going with the punt? Is this a fake punt? It is the fake punt. Who's he gonna throw it to? All right, Jesse Bates gets it. We're gonna pitch it. What's the flag? Was it illegal forward pass? Oh, we declined it. What a guy. Oh, get you, come on. Yup, <gasps> Damien Harris! Wait, oh my God. I didn't go for the end zone because I want to I wanna chew some clock. That was disgusting. I'm not even gonna score here. I'm just gonna chew it and then hand him the ball back. Looks like we're gonna have about five, 600K, I'm thinking. That's more than enough for Tyree. And that's the important part here. That's the end of the game. I need to see this stat line. What a trooper. Thanks for playing it out, bro. Hey, I'm gonna make sure I get him that 95, uh, that 95 DK. I got a wheel of my W. I got my challenge done. I got a ton of coins because he didn't rage quit. And, uh, you know, we're gonna make somebody's day. So all around good time all right let's look at these stats so number one our bench player damian harris 46 yards receiving kyle rudolph has 30 julio jones has 169 love that damian harris also has 24 that puts us at 269 cameron Brait has 20 to 89 and rob Havenstein can't catch for shit and i'm pissed about it 289 yards with bench players which is crazy multiply that by 2,000 coins we have 578,000 coins to spend on one single player that ladies and gentlemen is a 99 tyreek hill wow by the skin of my teeth i can buy this tyreek hill that's crazy yes i don't need to buy tyreek hill because i already had him but dude is a stud 99 overall he's 99 speed 94 jump 98 catching this is the exact card that i needed to win that playoff game because i'm gonna get man clamped but now I got 99 speed and a route technician. That's exactly what I need. Dude, not even three episodes ago, my wide receivers were so bad. All right, boys, we're sitting pretty at a 95 overall, and I still can get any pack from the store that I purchased with coins. It's pretty much gonna be this like this the rest of the season. The best pack is pretty much gonna be the Ultimate Legends Fantasy Pack. So those are all ass. Cortland Finnegan, though. Ocho Sig... She got 93 Ocho Cinco. Gotta love to see that. So no big rings here. Not gonna help us. The left guard Steve Hutchinson and no big rings there. So we didn't get anything that we really needed here. But actually, wait, am I out of my mind? This is better than my current left guard. It, it, Steve Hutchinson is. My left guard is at 83 right now. That's actually exactly what I needed. That's awesome. All right, that's gonna be it. But I gotta sauce this man a DK. He threw up power up Russell Wilson. EA, please don't ban me for this shit, you clowns. Dude, he's gonna love this shit. He was going off with this Metcalf. He was using the 80 overall, and we are going to sauce this man. The 95 stud, Metcalf. All right, let's go find his uh, power-up Russell Wilson. All right, QB Seahawks. Oh, boy. I don't actually know how the trade block works all too well. Dude, there's going to be a million of these up, isn't there? This ain't going to work. I have I have to assume this was him, but I need him to verify. He he, he offered that DK he was using. Sheesh! <laughs> Said five yups. All right, offer accepted. Congratulations, Hawks Bomb. All right, boys. That's gonna conclude an absolute banger of an episode. We are ready now, bro. We are ready. Like, now I just need to hustle my ass into the playoffs. I love this team. I really feel like this is my playoff contention team. This is my team that will not get swept out of the playoffs like last time. I'll see you guys in the next episode, though. Peace. Love you guys.